this is a reading for Sunday, the 8th of October. So if I've come across your feed, it's not a coincidence. And I will give you some letters in your name at the end of this reading to make sure I resonated with you. So let's see what's in store in the next 24 hours. Don't be surprised if you don't hear of somebody that has said something. I can see there's a little bit of deceit around you in the Seven of Swords energy. And what I'm feeling as well is that this is some kind of family member. It could be sister, mother, it could be mother-in-law, sister-in-law. And I'm not saying that this person has done this deliberately, but I can see some kind of comment, um, something about what you've done, some kind of judgment on their part. And this kind of rejection as well. And can you see she sat on the tree and she could topple off at any time, but she's not looking at the cup and she's only concentrating on these empty cups at the bottom here. So this person that's being quite deceitful around you, I feel isn't concentrating on the full things in life. You know, life isn't black and white. There's gray areas as well. And we're all human beings. I feel as well, that you're, you're blindfolded in relation to this particular situation. Can you see how she's holding her swords up there? So I think your spirit team just want you to be aware that sometimes people aren't how we think they are. People don't seem to be as they're portrayed on the outside. It's a bit like an egg. We have a hard shell, but we're soft underneath. So the spirit message for you today is don't hide behind the veil always see people for who they are and remember the different lunar cycles and how we go through those different cycles in relationships so just be wary of that today and study people and don't always give everything away sometimes silence is the perfect answer <laughs>